Hey guys, I'm at SHOT Show at the CZ booth. Check it out. Hank's doing a video over there. So uh, as soon as he's done doing his video, I'm going to go in there and just do a quick and dirty video. But if you want to see the full details about this new gun from CZ, go over to Hank's channel and uh, click on that video and watch his because it's all detailed. I'm just going to go in there and kind of just look at it and tell you my opinion about it. Let's go check it out. But this is like a competition gun, obviously. Yep, this is for folks who want to shoot yeah. limiteds. And uh, basically just a long slide, 9mm or 40. Um, you've got a little extra capacity than a standard 75, uh, a little wider magwell. Uh, basically, our TS has been our long slide, that we've just basically the same pistol for a long time. We're, we're basically combining the TS and our Checkmate, which is our open gun, using that Checkmate frame, which has a lot more refined trigger guard, better checkering. And then uh, on the other side, we've got a Got a thumb stop. I like that. That's oh, cool. Yeah. It's just cool. really, really comfortable shoot. Uh, adjustable target sight. It's got a fiber optic front. Um, just a, a really slick gun for the range. You said it's a factory tuned trigger. So. Yeah. Oh, yeah. What? How Single many pounds? Action only. Uh, yeah. That look. Yeah. Mm. But super low. Light. Sure it's super light. light. Yeah. Yep. Very cool. Awesome. And then these are your suppressor ready yep. handguns. So we're here. doing five different urban gray suppressor ready pistols. I like that. Um, extended nice. capacity, high night sights, threaded barrels, and then they're all in this. It's kind of a combination of flat, dark earth and gray. I like how these sights go all the way as far as possible to the yep. rear. Yep, and they kind yeah. of wrap around. Yeah, that's cool. Yep. And then that's just a shorter version? Yep, so this is the SPO one, and that's a full size, and this is a compact, which is the PO one. Very nice. And then we also do uh, the 75, and then we do a PO7 and a PO9, which are, those are our polymer guns. And uh, on both the PO1 and the 75B, you see that they're the, uh, the Omega version. Um, that means it uses the updated trigger system we're doing nowadays. Uh, really, really easily serviced by, a, by just somebody who doesn't have to have gunsmithing uh, oh, experience. Nice. Nice. Um, and you're actually able to swap it out. So right now it's, an, it's a safety model. A um, couple minutes work, you can change this over to a decocker model so oh, that wow. uh, it, it would operate like this one. So you, you just decock it and carry it uh, decocked. You have nice. a double action first pull and then single action after that. Nice. But if you're kind of like a 1911 guy and you want to carry cocked and locked, you can swap it over to be safety operation. That is very cool. Let me uh, try that out here. That's nice. Look at that. Now uh, look how short the throw is on that. It's actually a really short throw on there. That's amazing. Look how short that is. It's not very long at all. And it's ambidextrous. Very cool. Let's try this one here. A little bit of creep on after the reset. Not too shabby. Let's try the competition gun. Wow, that feels nice. There's a, a shot of that thumb rest on there. That's nice. Very nice. Look at those grips. And let's go ahead and rack it. Give it a squeeze. Reset. Wow, that was a really short reset and a really crisp break. Let's try that one more time. Check this out. So let it out to reset. Look at that. That was just a few millimeters and then press. I think that's probably two to three pounds, maybe. Insane, that was nice, very nice. All right, guys, that was just a quick and dirty look at the CZ handguns over at the CZ booth. If you want to see more of these uh, guns, go over to Hank Strange's channel and check him out. He has a little bit more details uh, from the reps. Look, look who we bumped into, man. It's Coleon Noir hanging out. I, I actually just saw Hank talking to him, but busy guy doing his thing. He took some pictures with him, but yeah. Hanging out at the CZ booth. You never know who you're going to bump into. I don't even have to give uh, an introduction of who you are. Only on Noir. How did you get the name? 
Okay. About the name. Yeah. The name is. I'm always in black. I've always, I've always loved the color black. Yeah. I always wanted the color black. Yeah. And so my friends would always point that out. And one of my other friends would always call me. <laughs> yeah, just, I love black. And one of my friends, his nickname for me was Killer Colleon. For whatever reason, don't know why. Oh, okay. And so when I was making my YouTube channel, yeah. I was looking for a name. I didn't want to be like, oh, boring real name, right? Yeah, yeah. So I said, hmm, okay, he kills me Colleon. We we'll do stick with Colleon. And then yeah. I was like, I like the color black, but Colleon black was just kind of boring. <laughs> so I was like, I'm going to be fancy. I'm going to let Colleon be boring. <laughs> yeah, that's it right he there. used to rob the truck hard. Yeah. Yeah. Right. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I wear yeah. Noir Noir now. Yeah, so yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Was, <laughs> well, there you have it. That's how go. There you have it, guys. I asked the tough questions. <laughs> you know, dig deep. Anyway, that's it. Take care. See you guys later.